Much of Ludwig Eberhard's adult life was spent either in war or protecting the interests of his family as well as the region of Fiedelbach. During the Thirty Years' War, Ludwig supported Gustavus Adolphus of Sweden. The Thirty Years' War was a conflict fought primarily between the forces of the Holy Roman Empire and the forces from Sweden, the Dutch Republic, and France. The cause of the war was the Holy Roman Emperor, Ferdinand II of Bohemia, attempting to limit the freedom of his Protestant subjects. The resulting conflict laid waste to much of continental Europe and was finally resolved with the Peace of Westphalia in 1648. The peace treaty led to a greater toleration of Christian religions in the European states, and more territory was granted to Sweden and France, thus limiting the role of the Holy Roman Empire in European politics. In return for his service, Ludwig was granted the monastery at Obermarktal in Germany in 1632. Soon after, he traveled there with Michael von Freiburg Opfingen, his wife Countess Amelie of the Rhine, and Johann Lehausen, the royal secretary to Adolphus. Though expecting a warm greeting, the four were arrested upon arriving in Obermarktal, while their company of guards was massacred by imperialist forces of the Holy Roman Empire. While Amelie was immediately released, the other three were handed over to Wolf Rudolf von Ossa. In April of 1633, Eberhard and Freiburg were exchanged for two counts held in Swedish captivity. Following the defeat of Swedish forces at the Battle of Nordlingen in 1634, Eberhard felt it too dangerous to remain in Fiedelbach and decided to move his family and his library to Worms. Eberhard died in 1650 at the age of 60, shortly after the family had returned to Fiedelbach. His son Hiskius inherited the committal title and with it the album Amicorum book that his father had scribed while at university. The album was later given to Ischius' son, Ludwig Gottfried von Hohenlohe Waldenborg Fiedelbach, when he died in 1685. What is amazing is that through all this turmoil, Ludwig held on to the album, something others may have left behind had they been forced to relocate their family.